Determining whether a person is good or bad is a complex process that requires going beyond what appears on the surface. Cultural, moral, and individual perspectives may influence this judgment in different ways. Goodness, like the sun, illuminates and warms its surroundings. This light and warmth inherently attracts others. True goodness, like a magnet, attracts those who seek purity in their souls. Evil, on the other hand, often hides behind the mask of kindness or sincerity. However, the reality behind this mask is revealed in time and the lies collapse. No matter how good a bad person tries to look, his true face will eventually reveal itself. The lie will be exposed sooner or later. Observing a person's behavior gives clues about his or her inner world. Some characteristics may indicate that a person is more prone to evil. Recognizing such behavior helps us to have healthier relationships with others and to develop ourselves as a better person. In this video, we will focus on five obvious behaviors that reveal people's true character. These signs are behaviors that bear the marks of evil. By watching the video to the end, you can learn to recognize these behaviors and take wise steps in your relationships. Let's get started. First behavior, no regrets. Think of it this way. A person refuses to admit that he or she is wrong, despite clear and unambiguous evidence to the contrary. Even when he or she is wrong, he or she clings to his or her decision, refuses to back down, and comes up with reasons to defend himself or herself. Instead of seeking understanding and reconciliation, they build walls of logic and endeavor to hide their mistakes. The lack of remorse, the inability to accept mistakes and learn from them can be a sign of a potentially dangerous character trait that lies deep beneath the surface. This stubbornness can manifest itself in different ways. Refusing to apologize, distorting facts, or making others feel guilty can be observed in this person's behavior. In contrast, true kindness is flexible and humble, recognizing that everyone makes mistakes and that mistakes are learning opportunities. A truly good person knows that apologizing and admitting mistakes is not a sign of weakness, but of strength and maturity. Therefore, when judging a person's character, it is vital to pay attention to how they deal with their mistakes. Refusing to repent even when wrong is a serious warning sign that outward goodness may in fact be just a skillfully worn mask. Second behavior, enjoys the suffering of others. A person who takes pleasure in the suffering of others often hides behind a facade of kindness and compassion, but this mask fails to conceal their true feelings. Instead of offering support or comfort in the difficult moments of others, such people may react with cold indifference or worse, with an expression of secret satisfaction. Perhaps they reveal their feelings only with a small smile or a subtle sign of contentment that goes unnoticed. Such behavior reveals a serious emotional disconnection and a deep lack of empathy. This lack of empathy not only harms those around them, but also indicates a great emptiness in the inner world. The inability to emotionally connect with the suffering of others and even to take pleasure in it is indicative of a potentially manipulative and malicious character. Sometimes this tendency manifests itself insidiously in the form of humor or ridicule. At other times, it is manifested in a refusal to lend a helping hand or a desire to take advantage of someone else's difficult situation. Some people exhibit this behavior out of a desire to gain power by exploiting the weaknesses of others. This indicates much more than simple insensitivity it in third behavior, non-commitment. This type of behavior is characterized by instability in one's beliefs and a constant tendency to change one's views. Although his or her words may initially seem sincere, they quickly lose their meaning because they are adapted to best benefit the situation at the time. Such a person may agree with you today, but change his or her entire stance tomorrow if a different option seems more attractive. Constantly changing opinions and not sticking to their own words reveal a deep selfishness and a tendency to turn the situation to their advantage. These people see relationships and commitments, values such as loyalty and honesty, as something that can be sacrificed for personal gain. Their inconsistency makes them unreliable. They may appear supportive and understanding, but this appearance is often short-lived and changes quickly depending on their self-interest. Such a pattern of behavior not only spoils relationships, but also creates distrust, uncertainty, and emotional instability among the people around them. 
Relationships with these people can be reassuring one moment and disappointing the next. This uncertainty can leave deep scars on both personal and professional relationships. Fourth, behavior complains a lot. A constant state of discontentment manifests itself in endless complaints. Such people find fault with everything and everyone in every aspect of life. They ignore or undervalue the positive aspects. They adopt a pessimistic outlook and focus on negativity, ranging from everyday problems to personal relationships and even world events. Rather than seeking solutions or adopting a more balanced approach, they prefer to get lost in the vortex of pessimism. This deep dissatisfaction shows that nothing is enough in their lives and that they are constantly craving more. This attitude creates a toxic environment not only for themselves, but also for the people around them and shows that they have lost the ability to appreciate the beauty of life. This behavior often reveals an ego-driven and ungrateful personality, unable to sincerely celebrate the success or happiness of others. Constantly wanting more and not being satisfied with anything can lead such individuals to manipulative and selfish behavior. Moreover, this dissatisfaction prevents one from finding inner peace and prevents one from feeling the fullness of life. In short, this attitude is a mask that hides a lack of gratitude and inner happiness. Some people use their complaints only to gain attention, sympathy, or material benefits. Unfortunately, these people rarely contribute constructively to society. Such individuals tend to control in five basic ways, and this need manifests itself in various ways. First, they offer help by presenting themselves as leaders or counselors. However, this help often harbors a hidden purpose of controlling those who do not favor their interests or do not conform to their truth. These outwardly sincere attempts at guidance are in fact a desire to mold people's actions and thoughts according to their own truth. They may often display an authoritarian attitude and demand that others conform to them without question. Lacking flexibility and tolerance, they cannot tolerate deviation from their ways. Another dimension of this controlling tendency is manipulation and emotional blackmail. These people resort to such methods to manipulate the decisions and behavior of others. The manipulation is so subtle and skillful that often the targeted people do not even realize that they are under control. This kind of desire for control also manifests itself in disrespect for personal boundaries and breaches of confidentiality. These people intervene in matters that do not concern them and try to explain it away with innocent reasons such as concern or interest. In reality, however, their aim is to exert and maintain influence over others. Finally, the tendency of such individuals to speak ill of others is also an important warning sign. This negative attitude is a reflection of a tendency towards manipulation and lack of respect for others. Noticing such behavior can give in-depth insight into a person's true character. However, it is important to remember that every person is complex and multidimensional. A few interactions or superficial observations do not reflect the whole character of a person. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to share your views with us in the comments. See you in the next video.